Hello Cup Coders and welcome back to the Cup Code server. Today we're going to actually finish moving my house over to the new location. Um, that includes I am going to take this workbench, this table here. I'm actually going to leave all of this sitting here. So whoever decides to take this house after me can have it. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab our equipment out first. I'm going to need to make some chests in the new house. Uh, to do that, we're going to go outside and we're going to get some wood because, you know, I'm almost out of wood. And I did a little bit of recon over at the new house, and it looks like all of my trees around the new house have grown. So we will have trees there when we get there. So we're going to fill up our inventory and then head straight over there. So we're just going to leave the trees here alone, and we're going to take a bunch of stuff with us as we go. Now let's see, this chest is empty, so now we just have all this stuff in here to take with us too. Alright, so we are full here. I'm going to go ahead and knock some things out of my inventory because we're going to need a little bit of space when we go over to the new area just for getting the stuff together and making the, making the chest. So home, new home. And of course, at some point today, after we finish moving all our stuff, we are going to have to go out there and get some sand and make some glass. Because we are missing our windows here. Alright, well we are here. Let's go ahead. And as I said, it looks like all our trees are grown. So we're going to go ahead and cut down a tree or two and make some chests. A little bit of wood there. I think this is going to be enough. Alright, we'll, just, we'll just let those uh, disintegrate right there. Go back inside to our, ch to our crafting bench and make some chests and get started on all this. So we're going to need four chests in total. And we got just enough wood. Look at how beautiful that is. Alright. All right, so now we have two private chests. Let's dump everything and go back and empty the other area. Empty the chests. I think it'll take two more trips from the old house to the new house in order to get all our stuff moved. Oh, wait, I have glass here. Hold on. All right, well, we got some of our windows in. All right. Let's go back to the old home. And get the rest, get some more of our stuff. Now, to quick move items, and I, I don't think I've ever told anybody this. I just kind of assume that everybody knows how to do this. To quick move items like I am, you're pressing, I'm holding shift as I click on the items. Home, new home. Alright, now let's grab anything that looks like a tool and get it out of here. Um, that'll help us organize our stuff a little bit better. I'll count torches as a tool. I'm going to take count the arcane compendium as a tool as well. Let's see. Oh, yep, buckets. That's a tool. All right, let's dump some more of this stuff in here. And everything else is a tool, so I'm going to throw that over in here. I'm going to make one more trip back. I think will be all I need. Um, let's grab the stone pickaxe while we're at it. Actually have a use for it. We're going we're gonna to grab this one too. Home. Old, old home. 
All right, that is it out of the chest now, guys. And we got to pick this up here. All right, we're going to take our table with us. And that is it here. So last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the protections off of everything. So to do that, here we first, let's see. Oh, man. Help. Ah, there it is. I knew it was in here somewhere. All right, so we're going to go CP remove. public see password see private see persist oh well, there's more to, to it than that I know that there's a way to remove the locking on this see remove ah see remove aha there we go see remove There it is. These are no longer protected. So whoever takes over this house, all you have to do is C protect. In fact, I'll go ahead and show it to you. C protect. Sorry. C private. And now that is protected by me. So if we go C remove, that removes the lock protection from it so anybody can access it. That also means that anybody can break it and take it as well. Now, if you want to make a chest that anyone can access, but they can't break it, then you use C public. All right. Last thing we need to do before while we're moving out is remove this. Dun, 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 dun. That breaks the protection in this area. As you see, when I walk outside, it no longer says that I'm entering or exiting my protected area. Bam, ba -da -bam. It only said it once, and that was after I removed the block. So now this is public. Anybody can have this this house now. It is open to the public. You are welcome to take it and have it, build on it, do as you please. It is yours for the taking. First come, first serve, as always. Oh, uh, last thing I need to do. Let's see. Slash home. Now I've got to figure out. Let's see. Help home. There we go. Slash delete home old home. I'm no longer going to need to be coming back here. Hmm. Home test, new home bed. Interesting. Alright, well let's see where home test is. Home test. Oh, yeah, I know where this is. Okay, the letter T6 is stuff. So we're going to we're going to go delete home test home haha <laughs> new home now I'm pretty sure my let's see home the only last thing I have is let's see home home which where the hell are we at now okay well I have no clue where this is I'm probably, I'm pretty sure I should though. Let's dig out. Let's find out where we're at. I'm pretty sure this is, ah yes, I remember where this is. This is the first place that I stopped for the night in uh, when I first started he heading out this series. I actually stopped for the night here and we called it home. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and delete home. Delete home, home, which means I should only have one home left, and that would be new home. Delete home, new home, and bingo. Last home left is my administration home.
Uh, Alright. This is the administration home. So this is the house that I play in when I'm not playing on the survival video and for this particular series. Um, so we're not going to do anything in here. I actually am going to remove this home set at some point because well, I have other means of getting here other than using home. I'll tell you what, let's go... Whoa, somebody was attacking me there. So we're at spawn. And I still have not fixed the book, by the way. I will be getting to that at some point. So we're going to go back over here to Urban Magia. That is where our new house is located. And I don't know, guys. What do you think? Does this need handrails? Do we need handrails on these? Uh, you, you let me know. Just post something in the comments below and let me know if you think we need ha handrails. And if you do, you know, then I'll come in and I'll add some handrails. But I'm kind of, I don't know, I was kind of thinking, uh, it's a little bit more devil may care without the handrails. Alright, while we're here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Keep going, keep going. I saw him over here in our house where it's safe oh well, kind of not really we don't have any doors or furnaces all right so now we got our furnaces back up now we need some doors so let's grab these wood is that all the wood I have oh no we need some more wood Okay, we're going to have to go chop down some wood. Alright. Dumping this stuff. Uh, we need to place our inscription table too. I will. We will be getting to use it. And I'm actually going to place it like that. I want it kind of on an angle there. Let's see. I'm going to throw this up in here. I'm going to throw the sand in here. Um, anything else we can take out of here because that inventory is full. Negative. Okay, so we're going to throw this extra stuff over here for now. Uh, we need a sword. I don't have one. Um, actually, not allowed to use an iron sword anymore because I am a higher level now. We are an official. We are a wizard. Even though I don't have any spells yet, we still can't use iron swords. We're not allowed to. And that's part of what the book is going to tell you. <coughs> Is that as a wizard, you are not allowed to use an iron sword once you're, once you're past level 5. Uh, let's see. We have an item frame. I'm sure there was something that went in that item frame and it went on the wall. But I'm not seeing it. You, you know what? I have a gold ingot. No any redstone. No. So I don't have any redstone, so I can't make a clock. We'll have to, we'll have to fix that. And we'll have to go mining soon, too. All right. Let's put that item frame back in there. Grab that. Now I need some wood, so we're going to grab this. And I'm going to grab my normal equipment out of here. And I think that's good for now. Let's go getting wood. Wood, 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 wood. hear them. Whoa! Yeah! Hit me again! <laughs> Alright, now, it has stopped raining. It is becoming daytime soon, so we'll be safer. Take these guys out and gain some experience from them. We definitely need the experience. And I think we'll have to go... Are you blue? Yes, you are blue. So 
So I'm not too worried about him because I don't have any spells. You don't hurt me now. Haha. <laughs> now this guy over here on the other hand. Gotcha. Die. Hey, while we're here, let's go ahead and pick up some of this sand here, huh? We need some more windows. Oh, hi. Yeah, buddy. Haha. <laughs> Meanwhile, all the enemies are dying off in the distance, and my timer has gone dark. I can no longer see it. It's on a cell phone, so after 10 minutes, my cell phone goes dark, so it doesn't track my timer. Any I mean, it still tracks it, it's just not showing it where I can see it. So I have to swipe the phone. All right. I think that's just, that is way more than enough sand. I honestly think that we'll, that's enough sand for us to... To make all the windows we need. Don't worry, horsey. I'm coming after you in a little while. I'm def. I'm going to need a nice, valiant steed. Um, I'm actually not going to grab a horse because in this particular version of Minecraft, horses are still majorly buggy. You know what? I need some food too. Is that? A, nah, that's just regular potato. I don't want to eat regular potato. Why not cook them? There we go. Cook pork chops and steaks. Should probably throw those into the other. Yeah, that's exactly what I should do. Let's grab all the food out of here, and we'll throw that into the other chest, the tool chest. That's what we call it. Into the tool chest. And later on, once we get mining and stuff, we'll have... We're going to go dig down and make a treasure room under here. All right. And we'll keep that on our, on our man. Keep that on our person right there. All right, so we've got a few more slots up there available. See, there's some sand right there. I need this coal. Ooh, we need more coal. We are almost out of coal, so we are definitely going to have to go mining. So we're going to throw this in there. And... Eight. How many more do we need? We need two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so that that's enough. We'll just, we'll just use that. Good, 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 good. Throw this in here. We'll plant this. Always replant your trees. Even if you don't plant them near your house, plant them further away. Make forests. Make forests. Anything else in here I can remove around? I got a book and quill. Did I write anything in there? No. I guess that's good. I'm not telling. I don't have any instructions for myself. Good, good, good. That's going to be good, good, good. Yeah, all right. All right, we're definitely going to have to get, get a mining operation going because we need to get some of this Ars Magica materials so we can start making our work, our crafting bench and everything else. Um, yeah, so we're going to need more glass later too. So we're definitely going to need a little bit of stuff. Um, let's see, we have 28 torches. Uh, okay, we're going to take an iron pickaxe with us. Let's grab this other stone pickaxe here because we are going mining. We've got 10 minutes left. We need to build a mine shaft. Um, I'm saying right here it would be a good place for our mine shaft. And I did not bring a shovel. Let's go grab our shovel. Shovel! And it's about to break. Go figure. Now, we can use iron for our pickaxes and our shovels. We just can't use iron. Well, technically not allowed to wear iron armor. That's why I'm unarmored right now. Um, we can't use iron armor. We can't use iron swords. So any weapons or battle-related stuff, uh, wizards are only allowed to use leather and stone. That's it. All right, so we got that. Let's see, I need another shovel. That's what I need. So there's a new shovel. When that one breaks, we have a couple irons here. Let's go ahead and grab another one just to be safe. I do that all the time. 
I really think that they should be able to be left in there. Um, do we, where's wood? Son of a bitch. Excuse my language. You prick. Walking into my house and blowing up. What the heck do you think you are? Bin Laden? Freak? All right. Um, I don't have enough sticks. I don't have enough wood. Um, yeah, I meant to go get some wood. Oh, well. All right. We need an, we, seriously, scatterbrained here. I, all right. We're going to come straight out from here, right here. And I want to come over here and dig right in here. This is where the mine shaft is going to be, right in here. And I want it to go down right here. Here we go. Digging in. Oh, and look, we find iron already. <laughs> That's how things are going to be. I found quite a bit of iron here. Well, that's good. That's good. You always need iron. Always need iron. But we need magical stuff right now. We need some Ventium. We need... Oh, man. We need all the magical stuff. Iron can wait. <laughs> As I'm continuing to dig it. Iron can wait. Yeah, that's a lot of iron right here. All right, all right, all right, good enough, good enough. Moving on. And we should definitely find some Ars Magica materials here. Uh, we are far enough out that this was not generated until after the Ars, we installed Ars Magica. So we should definitely find some good stuff here. And that's part of the reason why I built the, um, the Magia, the Urban Magia here. Is because it is far enough out for the Ars Magica stuff. With any luck, we'll find ourselves into a ravine down here or something. I just hate it when you when you go digging downstairs like this, and you get way, way, way down. You find bedrock, and you don't find anything until you hit bedrock. That just annoys me. And then I'm like, it's all the luck, you know. And that happens quite a bit. Yeah, bust, all, bust your butt to dig all the way down here and you don't find anything. All right. Throw another torch up. Theoretically, I can still see. But I know on the video recording, you guys can't. Even though I've got my gamma way up. And I've tried, when I do go into dark areas like that, I've tried to lighten it using my editor. And it just doesn't always work. It does work sometimes, but... It looks really crappy, and so that's why I don't do that. That's why I tend to try to keep it lit up enough so that you guys can see. Um, I know it's a waste of torches for me to do it the way I do, but at least you guys can see as I'm wandering around down here underground. Seriously, all this, and I'm not finding any Ars Magica stuff, really? Come on. Hey, at least we got plenty of stone. Yeah, maybe we can build our first altar out of stone. There you go. Of course, stone is the same level as wood. Look. More iron. I saw a Facebook post once that says, I'm rich enough. I just left the iron in the cave. Yep, yep, yep. You'll never see me pass up iron. Okay. If I do, I didn't see it. I don't know. Maybe I would. I mean, it, it depends. Like, playing a, playing a magician, I might not need iron as much. So if I end up getting to a point where I've got plenty of iron for all my uses, and, you know, I've got like 10 stacks of iron, no, I probably wouldn't pick up iron at that point. And why would you? Alright. Very annoying. Broke a pick. Still no iron. Still no Ventium. And I know this is Nars Magica generation stuff because we saw lotus, lotus flowers up on the water. I just need to be more patient. Get down there. Mm. 
Whoa! Perfect! Kind of. Maybe that's perfect. All right, well, we found something at least. It may not be Ventium dust it may, or anything like that. Um, at least it's a dead end of one, so it makes it easier to find our way back. Oh, that's deep. Oh, it continues down there. Uh. Whoa! God, I hate that! They're just gonna keep coming! Alright, we should definitely find something in here. If we're out far enough. If we're not out far enough, that's gonna be annoying. Is that gold? No, that's gold. All right, we are definitely out far enough, as you see. Here we go. Here we go, Ventium. Ha! -ha! We're finding it. We are finding what we are looking for. Good, good, good. Chimerite. Oh, my phone shut off again. Up, oh, it says we have two minutes left. That's okay. We're going to keep mining for a little bit. I might go over. I might go over. And some Ventium. We're definitely going to need some Ventium. We're going to dig up all the Ventium we find. I mean, you could easily go back into into town and or and purchase some of these materials. Because I did build a shop in town that is infinite that can sell some of these items. I'm going to pick up this gold, too. You never know when we need it. Of course, we need some redstone so we can make our clock. I haven't even seen that. Nothing up here. Okay, moving on down. I am not dropping down, by the way. That is That would just be insanity right there. All right, so we're good there. Let's make this a little bit safer for me. <laughs> and more iron. Yep. Never do what I just did. Never dig straight up in Minecraft, folks. <laughs> it's a very dangerous maneuver. Actually, it's not so much dangerous as long as... Where is it? Where is it? Video settings. As long as your particles are on all. Because what that means is if there is lava above the block that you're about to break, you will see little droplets of lava coming through the block. If I remember correctly, we did not go this way, so let's head up this way and see what's up here. And more Ventium. Good, good, good. So we might actually be able to make our spell altar soon. And get to casting. Um, theoretically, I could head over... There, there's a couple other place people that that are on the server from time to time, and I could theoretically head over to their houses and use their spell crafting altar, but I'd rather do it myself. I think it, it just means a lot more when you do it yourself. All right, how much ventium we got? We got 11 ventium so far. Keep going for just a little bit. All right, well, that's it for that round. That round. All right, we're going to head back up. Uh, we're going to cook what we've got. And... Ooh. See, I'm about to pass up iron. I don't want to do that. More iron. Yeah, I keep...
keep our keep an eye out. Let's see what's up this way real quick. Yeah, more of every more of the same thing. More of the same thing. Alright. So we're headed down and out. And we can explore more of this later, but for now we're just gonna head on back up. Because that actually our I, my phone just went off saying, hey, time's up. And at some point I'm going to come back and we're going to put stairs in here to make it easier to navigate. And I want to put a nice little... Ah, I just like things normal. I want to put a nice little cave entrance at the top to make it look nice. So it's not just you know a big hole in the ground and you can actually tell that it is a mine entrance a mine shaft um, so we will do that at some point as well but for now oh wait 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 i am not logging out until we have some freaking doors on our house they are not having creepers and and zombies walking in while we're crafting stuff that is not going to happen and we got to finish those windows too we can't have spiders crawling in through the windows We need two doors. Let's move some stuff out of here. Now, as always, I stand on the inside and place the doors on the block right outside. That way it doesn't really butt up to the, to the door. And actually, I think it looks better when it's sitting outside the door like that, outside the house. But that's just personal opinion. All right, where did I put that glass? And you know, we did not find any coal. So we're going to have to go mining again just to find some coal. And because we definitely need it, uh, we're going to throw this Ventium in there. I think it's more important for us to get the Ventium smelted than it is for us to smelt gold at this point. Uh, we can still smelt the gold. It's just going to cost wood to do it, which we've got plenty. We've got a whole forest growing outside. So let's smelt this stuff. Now, of course, it costs a lot of wood to smelt, smelt the gold. And in fact, I could probably go ahead and cut down some trees and make some charcoal just to power the furnaces. Probably should, actually. All right, we got all that. Next thing we're going to need, we need, where is it? The crafting altar. So I need smooth stone and ventium dust. So it's a good thing that we went and found ventium dust. Now we'll actually be able to finish our crafting altar. Uh, but first we need a piece of smooth stone. So to get that... There we go. Now that we'll have our smooth stones, so we can make our crafting altar. So maybe in the next episode, we'll actually build our crafting altar. I don't think we'll actually be able to use it yet, but we'll get it built. Um, we're also going to need, where is it? It is the, the Oculus. So we need some blue topaz and, of course, some coal, which we just ran out of. wasn't in time all right uh, well you know what let's throw the rest of this back in there and let's go chop down another tree find me a nice small tree I don't want one of the big trees here we go nice small tree we'll chop it down That'll make enough wood to power both furnaces until they're done, I think. I hope. Alright, and we're going to do it just like this. A little trick to it. There we go. So we chop them down into sticks. They tend to provide a little bit more of a cooking thing not a whole lot um most people probably wouldn't even notice it i think i it, i don't know the exact stats on it but i think like three pieces of stick to one piece of wood or something i don't know 
But at least everything is getting smelted. We'll have all our Ventium ore smelted. We'll have all our gold smelted. And we'll be ready to go tomorrow. Oh, not everything getting smelted. Shoot, we got plenty of iron to smelt too. I might have to go cook some more. And grab some more trees. Alright, well I'm going to just go ahead and let that iron smelt like that as it is. And we're going to go ahead and put every drop everything into the chest where they belong. And we're going to call it an episode here. Because it really is an episode here. Uh, while we're here, let's go ahead and make this real quick. So we have it for the next episode when we need it. There is our crafting altar, so we'll be able to use that in the next episode and actually build us our crafting altar. So I'll go ahead and drop everything now. All right. And as you see, everything is empty. Thank you for watching. As always, a like, comment, share. Let us know you care. See you in the next episode.